right. Hey guys. What? What? <laughs> I can't even talk. My name is Chris Vineyardin. You all know that. Welcome to my vlog. You all know I do a five minute vlog. Anyhow, I'm just giving you a quick update because I have been, I don't know what the word is, um, inconsistent with my uploading. And part of that is because I've been in between training sessions, training programs or my experiments or whatever. So I just want to give you a quick update today. I am getting back on it on Sunday. Um, one thing about me is that when I do a training program or I do an experiment, I like to have a calendar that shows me all the days and shows me when I'm going to start and when I'm going to end. And I'm, I don't know if you want to call it OCD or if it's just a personal tick, but I cannot start like a day before. I have to start on the day. And I, you know, you guys all know that I am not about moderation. <laughs> I'm either all in or I'm all out. <laughs> so this Sunday, I am all in training for the Iceman. Um, yeah, I've been working on getting my back up, up and running, my back healthy. And my bike is at the shop being checked over, but I do have some backup bikes to work, to ride on and train. So yeah, I'm going to get back into the eating healthy foods like I was doing before. And I have 10 weeks to train for the Iceman. Um, let me show you my calendars here real quick. So, <clears throat> excuse me, cut. The first calendar I have is of the race dates. The race dates, uh, the Iceman Cometh is November, the beginning of November. And about two weeks before that, I have a race called Peak to Peak. And that's, I will also pre-ride the Iceman Cometh race course then. Um, and then I want to show you my, um, I'm going to be working hard on the bike for two weeks and then I'll take a third week will be like a recovery week. And that's usually what people do when they're training. They take, or I'm sorry, three weeks of training and then one week of recovery. So you work hard for three weeks, then you kind of take it easy. Work hard for three weeks, take it easy. So you can see my calendar for that. And then I'm going to show you each day I'm going to do different kinds of rides. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I will be riding at lunch at work. So I'm just going to go out on the road and get some miles in. Then on Fridays in the afternoon after work, I will go to Yankee Springs and hit the trail. Uh, and then Saturdays and Sundays, there's a trail that's closer to our house called the Upper Makatawa. It's a shorter trail, but that'll keep me moving on the weekend. Um, then we got... Then I'm going to be doing races. I'm sorry, <laughs> cut that out. I'm going to be doing training every other day is going to be hard training. And then those odd days, I'm going to be just spinning on the bike that we just call it spinning, but I'll just be taking it easy. That way you're doing a hard day of work. And then the next day is a rest kind of, you get on the bike and you spin. So your body keeps moving, but it recovers. And then the next day is a hard day. And so I'm going to do that every other day for 10 weeks. And that way, some weeks I'll have three days of hard training and some weeks, four days. So, and then uh, putting it all together, this is what my calendar looks like with everything all together. So um, that's my quick little update. Thanks for watching, guys. And on Sunday, I will be back to the daily vlog, vlogging my progress to the Iceman Cometh 10-week mark. Or whatever. I don't know. Here we go. I'll see you on the trail.